Welcome to Mr. Mark's Classroom. My name is Mark Jones and you're in our resource room and I wanna show you a great idea that you can get ready for Easter or maybe even something for Mother's Day. So you think about this as a spring activity. So you're gonna be using paper plates. Oh my goodness, don't you love crafts with these things? They're very available. And so I'm gonna pull one of them off here, set that one aside, and we're gonna make this little basket. So what we do is provide everyone a little square that they can use to put in the very middle of their, of their plate. Simply draw or trace around it so that way there is a pattern to follow. And then you can take your ruler and simply finish the line. Let's do the dotted line first on this side and this side and you could even have these done ahead of time for smaller children and the dotted line over here so we're basically going to be making a hashtag by the time we line all these lines up this one can be solid so that way we can keep it clear in our thinking what we're doing solid on this side as well now you're going to be making two cuts you're going to cut along the dotted line so let's do that next dot, dot. and I think whenever you're having your crafts with your kids keep your conversation going it's a great time even though you're not looking at each other in the eyes you're at least getting to have these great conversations so now around the square Let's go ahead and do some folding so that we have it all limbered up and ready to fold where we want it to fold. All right, so what this means is the part that we cut, the flaps that we cut on each side are going to be the outside flaps. So fold up the middle sides and fold them in. You see how I fold them in like this? Good. And then we're gonna fold this side up in order to make, I think I can hold it for you just so you can get an idea so that we can see. Now, that almost makes a square, so that means you need to loosen it up and hold it out a little bit. Here's what we're gonna do. By adding the handle to it, I just cut a strip, almost the width of your, of your ruler, and we're going to Hold it all in place, these three pieces, each side and that strip for the handle, and put your hole punch in there. And if your hole punch is too short, then you can simply, with the teacher's help, fold it all up and use the X-Acto to poke through. Be sure not to get your finger. That would be a bad day <laughs> so the teacher can poke the hole and the child can help by threading through the brad and then opening it up if you've got some some hole punch that are long extended length then it'll work great but I just don't happen to have that so now I'm gonna fold this side and I need to bend the handle over Hold up that, and now I can punch the hole through here as well. And I just kind of give it a little drill like that. That way I'm not taking a big stab, being dangerous. And then slide the brad through and open it up on the inside. And there's two sides to it, so be sure you open both of them. Now, you need to remember you can decorate this simply by using crayons like we did here and just go across it like the basket on the edge and then even at the bottom we can even outline this part and do it a different color and the handle as well. Now some people might not realize but you can you've even use a sharpie, maybe not black but another color if you don't want this gold part to be um, so gold you can even do it like on this we did this one with purple 
on a purple Sharpie. And so that way it helped disguise that a little bit. So that gives you an idea about making a basket. You might think about that for the spring, for Easter, or even for Mother's Day. It would make a nice little gift craft for the kids to give their parents or mothers. So I have lots of great ideas that you can check out in our kids ministry time saver notebook. The time saver notebook has things for preschool, ideas for children, and it has big helps for those in leadership so that you be able to use such as the, um, the notes that you need to send home with kids, the, the teaching pages, the training things that you should give to your teachers big, big help. And you can do this as an automatic download because they're available digital now, or you can request a print copy. Listen, all this is brought to you by the Sharpen Conference. It's going to be here in Oklahoma City on April 29th, and we'd love to have you be a part of our one day workshop that's going to be here. It'll be a great day for preschools, children's teachers, as well as our, our ministers and people in leadership. We want to also invite you to be a part of our Kids Ministry 411, which is April 11. Get it? 411. We're going to be giving you great information that day. It's a virtual conference. You just watch it on your computer. It's no charge. We just want to invite you to be a part of it. We're thrilled to have you at Mr. Mark's Classroom.